Hi, and welcome back to Bo Sickler Room. Well, in preparation with the visit down to uh, Wharf in, in Derbyshire uh, over the weekend, what I need to do is move some fish around. Uh, so I've got one empty tank already, which is this one here, which I'll show you in a minute. Uh, and I've got another tank, which has got the cutter eye breeding pair in with a load of fry. It's got two minor eye in it and it's got a Nicky Nagy Gwent. So if I move those as well, that frees me up with two different tanks. So looking at the list at Wharf and what I'm thinking of getting, it's, they're actually from different places. So if I free up two tanks, uh, I'll be able to quarantine them correctly. So let's have a look, see what I'm gonna move uh, and then I'll try and catch them all. <laughs> Tidy the tank up a little bit and get ready for the weekend. So these are the fish that I need to catch. So as you can see, there's two minor eye in there, two female minor eye. Uh, there's actually the pair of cutter eye, which is these two here. There's a spare female, which is over here somewhere. And there's the Nicky Dagger Gwens. So I need to catch those. And what I'll do is I'll catch all the fry as well. Uh, and I'll raise those on, well, as many as them as I can catch. Uh, so if I do that, give this tank a good clean out and get it ready for um, for what I find at Wharf at the weekend. So what that would do, it would leave me with this tank empty. This tank's already empty. It just needs some uh, decoration put in it, some rocks and I can put the cutter eye fry in this one to grow along. And a tank right next to the red tiger motos. So let's go on and catch them and see how we get on. But that's all the fish caught and moved over. There actually, there was three female minor eye in the end. This one looks a bit beat up. Uh, bear in mind, they have been in the tank with a breeding pair of cutter eye. <laughs> like for the last month. That one in the middle looks fine. That's the spare female cutter eye. And that's the other one. So I've put them in the tank with the Nicky Ragga Gwens. Uh, that's the female there looking all sparkling and fantastic. The male hiding in the corner over here. And uh, I don't think he likes anything new going into his tank. <laughs> Aye, right, so that's, that's that tank with all those fish caught. Move on to the tank next week. This is where I put the, the male Nicky Dagger Gwents. You can spot him. He was definitely there two minutes ago. He'll be hiding at the back. He's probably getting picked on by, uh, by, by the Passionis. Well, we'll save that for another day. I put the cutter right pair in with the Asfraki, uh, mainly to act as divot fish. A bit like Andy Woods, a uh, bit like Andy Woods does with his convicts. Uh, so yeah, I put them in there. They've gone straight at the back behind the filters and I've not seen them since. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, it was only like half an hour ago. So yeah, it'd take them a little bit of while to come out. There's Fracky, they're really curious. I put that spare plant pot in before and the four of them were over there all looking round it, investigating it every side. So yeah, they're fantastic these. Fantastic fish. So let's get some Barry White music on and see whether we can get them breeding. With the cutter eye fry, I've managed to catch nine. I'm sure I counted 15, 16 a couple of days ago, so they've probably been picked off. Unless it was when I took the rocks out to, uh, to catch all the fish. Like some of them might have, getting, might have gotten nibbled then. But yeah, let's grow these ones on and keep the line going. So what I'm left with Put some rocks in this tank. So this is for the species of fish. I 
I'm just hoping that Wharf have still got them. But yeah, that's looking much better, that tank. Put some lights up for it as well. I've just put the heater in as well to get it up to temperature, all ready for the weekend. And this was the tank that had the cutter eye in it. So yeah, I took everything out. I've given the, the sand a good rinse, put all the decorations back in, cleaned out the filters. Just need to top the water level up. But yeah, I'll do that at the weekend. And yeah, so it's off to Wharf. So probably the next video is gonna be a shop tour of Wharf and what they've got in. And uh, possibly what I've, what I've actually brought back with me. But yeah, really pleased with the fish room at the moment. It's, uh, it is good when you get the good back. Uh, but it is good when you get the bug back. <laughs> and uh, you've actually got some, some space to go out and buy some new fish. So yeah, all's well in the fish room at the moment. So I'll close it there. See you all on the next video, probably in Wharf. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button, click the like button, all that nonsense. And I'll see you all on the next one.